Hi friends, it's Kim with Seat Days Creations. Welcome back everybody. It's great to see you again. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day today. Well, today I wanted to do a haul. I have quite a bit of stuff here I wanted to share with you. Some's from Dollar Tree, some from uh, Target, and some from TJ Maxx, and a few Christmas presents I've been working on getting. So anyways, I just wanted to quickly tell you, um, we are probably not going to be building on the land that we purchased. Uh, we are more than likely going to be selling our house. Um, I think we're going to try to get down the market by January. So I'm going to be working quite a bit around the house doing that kind of thing. Um, working on painting and cleaning and, you know, getting all my blinds cleaned and all that stuff. So everything's ready for come January because we got all the holidays in between. And we're going to be looking for a new house um, just to move into for, um, you know, for forever probably. We're probably not going to be building because we didn't really, really realize how expensive it was going to be. And especially with COVID going on, all the prices of lumber, cement, everything is up. So we're just going to probably buy a house. And as we do that and as we walk through houses, I will try to video those for you and share them with you on my channel. Um, but my videos may be a little bit sporadic, um, just as when I can sit down to do one while I'm not you know, working in the house, um, but I'll try to do as best I can to get back on here and do videos. But this is gonna be kind of long, so let's get busy on this. Um, I wanna show you probably in order of when I got things. So I'm gonna show you what's in this bag from Target. Now everything in here is not from Target. Actually, a couple of these things are from Walmart. And these are some berries that I picked up. Aren't these beautiful? Look at that, all the uh, snow on them and stuff. Cute, cute, cute. And the leaves have, you know, snowy look on them too. I thought these would be really pretty in my wreath, which I'm gonna be doing that on video probably very soon. And um, I have this. So I bought two of these. They were $3.98. Well, that's not right. Yes, it is, $3.98, it says right there on the tag. Can you see it? Um, anyways, $3.98 and I bought these at Walmart and they were out in one of those boxes, you know, in the, actually out in the garden center at my, my Walmart. Pretty, right? Okay, because some of this other stuff in here is for actually the wreath. So first off, these. Then I also picked up these snowy, aren't these pretty? These snowy um, pine cones, aren't they? Look at those. They look so, it, it looks so real, doesn't it? It really looks like snow on there. Um, these were, oh, I didn't get these there. I got these at Hobby Lobby. I've got a little mix of everything here. I picked these up at Hobby Lobby, $6.99. But aren't these cute? And they were half off. But these are pretty, aren't they? Those, they're gonna go in there too. So all this is gonna be, plus that other stuff I showed you, is gonna go on this wreath. It's gonna be a gorgeous wreath. I can't wait to work on it. So anyways, and what I, else I got at Walmart, I picked up some more ribbon. I picked up this ribbon. I wanted some like thinner ribbon, as well as something to make, you know, a real pretty bow on that wreath. So I got this. This has the snow on the edges, see, on there. It's all wired ribbon. Um, it was $7.98 and it's 45 feet. Is it pretty? So I got that ribbon. I also got this ribbon that has, I pulled this out so you can see it well. Um, this is Merry Christmas. And these are all, you know, I can make a, a loop with it. It'll hold a loop, you know, it's all wired. So really pretty ribbon. Again, this was $7.98. And this is 45 feet also. So I got those two ribbons along with those other ribbons I had. So this is everything. I think I'm ready to make the wreath now. So I have everything that I needed for that. Okay, then I just wanna show you a couple of things. I, I, well, I'll do this all at once because I'm gonna put these over here. Let me go back to Hobby Lobby because I went to Hobby Lobby with Amy and we she got a couple things for like a little tree she's gonna do in her room. And everything she's doing is kind of pink. <laughs> but anyways, I picked these up when I was there at Hobby Lobby that day. These are $12.99, but they were 50% off. And they're just these, you know, rings of beads. I mean, obviously you can make these if you combine the beads. But aren't they? I love the neutral look. It'll go great on the tree that I put in this room. My neutral kind of tree that I do in here. Um, but I just thought they were cute and they would be good for there in that area. So I bought those at Hobby Lobby. So I'm gonna set those aside because I don't think I have, I have anything else from Hobby Lobby here. No, I have stuff from Target though. So I'm gonna show you all that. 
Okay, I went because I always get excited about what they have in the dollar spot, you know? Everybody does, I think. But at the time that we went, the first time, they, the dollar spot was still Halloween and stuff because it was before Halloween. So we went back to Hearth and Hand and they did have a lot of the Hearth and Hand Christmas stuff out. So I bought these and what they are is napkin rings. I don't know if I can get them apart. But they're just like, um, it's made of, oh, what's that called? Cedar, it's like cedar tree. And each one of them um, is round like this. I don't know if you can see there, but that's about what it looks like. And it'll go around your napkin ring. And I thought it was just so pretty. Well, not pretty, but just, you know, it's just greenery. And I thought it would look nice. Um, so these were $7.99. And I bought two sets because at this table back here, my farm table, uh, we can sit eight there. And I don't have enough chairs. We always have to pull some chairs around. But um, I bought eight of these because I have an eight-piece play setting of Christmas dishes. So I thought these would look pretty. So I got those. It was $7.99 each. And then I bought this one wreath that they had. It's just a small one. But it's got red berries on it. It's also, again, the same um, cedar-looking. But pretty because I thought this would look... You know, nice, I've got that one sign that um, says Merry Christmas. It's like a barn door and I hang it. This will look nice on it. So this is a $9.99 is how much it cost. It's not very big, you can see from the back um, about how big it is, but it's super cute. And they were picked over already. I mean, I tell you, the people were looking at through that like crazy. Now, another day we went, I did go through the dollar spot and I picked up this one candle, and it says it's beginning to smell a lot like Christmas, and it's just a red candle that had white ones, but I wanted to pop a red on my two-tier tray type thing. Um, but they had a red, white, maybe green? I can't remember the other one. Maybe there was black, I don't remember. But it says it's beginning to smell a lot like Christmas. This one, it's not very strong. It's called North Woods. But I just thought it, you know, the, the little pop of red would look cute on, you know, a two-two tray or something. So that's why I got it. And it was three dollars at the dollar spot, or the what is it? The dollar, the three dollar, the five dollar, the seven dollar at the dollar spot. Anyways, and I got these too. I just thought they were super cute. They're about the right size to stick on a two-tier tray, especially this. These would look nice here in this on this two-tier tray back there because it's, you know, in my living room area. And you've got these little, and they would look cute if they had just like a little wreath on the front, just super cute and small and, you know, but you can use them anytime because they don't have like snow on them or anything like that. I have some other metal um, ones that I got. I think I got those two at Target um, that have that snowy stuff on the top. But these were $5 in the dollar spot, <laughs> or at least that's what I call it. But aren't they cute? They had other ones that had like a wood um, top on it. It was bigger and it had wood as the roof and it was metal, you know, galvanized metal below. Um, and they also had some other ones, but I just picked out these small ones because I thought they'd be, like I said, great for like a two-tier tray. You know, they look good on there. I'm going to set that back in there and sell that too. So they all go together. Okay, so there's Target. And then I've gone to TJ Maxx a couple times because I just love that store. Um, so let me show you the first time I went, because Amy was with me, and I picked up a couple things from there, and I just think are adorable. I got this little gnome. Isn't he cute? He's ceramic, has that beard. Oh, here's my light on there. Let me see if I can switch this a little bit. There. With this little gnome. Isn't he adorable? He's so cute, isn't he? And he opens up, so I guess you could put candy in there or something, you know, or something. But um, yeah, he's that little hat and it opens up and he's got that little bitty nose. And this was, it's probably on the bottom, $5.99 at TJ Maxx. But isn't he just adorable? They had a lot of gnomes like, you know, the stuffed ones and stuff. So cute, so cute. And I know that Dollar Tree had some small gnomes, which would have been perfect for like a two-tier tray or something. I don't know if my store ever had them or if they just went hot, you know, went like hotcakes and we just didn't get them. Because I think, I think I mentioned to you before, or I thought about mentioning it. I was watching a video 
I think it was Auntie Cuckoo, and she was at a Target looking at the hearth and hand. Well, my hearth and hand is not very big. It's like a section of the store, but it's not super big. Um, it's like one like aisle or whatever with hearth and hand, you know, with hearth and hand stuff. Hers was like a whole, like, big part of a department store. I mean, it was huge. So California gets a bigger, bigger, it was a lot bigger than mine. Lots bigger than mine. <laughs> um, the hearth and hand, you know, section at the Target. Mine is small compared to hers. But anyways, I just wanted to show you that because I thought he was so cute. And then I picked up this pillow because I thought it was adorable. I just love the red and white ticking on it. And I didn't realize it was Ray Dunn at the time. It didn't even occur to me that it was. I just picked it up, threw it in my cart. It wasn't until I was looking to see how much it was, I saw the tag down here and it says Ray Dunn. This was $16.99. Whoops. Isn't it cute? It's nice and smooshy. And it just says Mary right there. And I just like the red and white. That's what drew me. I think it was on the shelf like this. And I thought, oh, great. I'll just, you know, get that because it's so cute and you can layer. And then it has this Mary here. And I didn't realize it at the time. But isn't it cute? Cute pillow for Christmas. And then they were just putting these out and I had to pick one up. Look at this tray. Is this not adorable? With the wood handle up here. It's wood down here on the, this part. It's got this little tag on here. It's um, leather and it says natural wood made in India, I guess. But isn't that cute with the metal that goes around here? Just small. I mean, can you see, like, I could set, I don't want to break this, but my little guy could sit on here. On here, you know, maybe with a, a tree or something. And then maybe my candle from, or like one of my, my little houses could sit on here too. Here, let me pick that up so you can see that. But you know what I mean? It just could set a couple of things on here and it'd be really cute for Christmas. So, you know, if I had a tree or something, I could set that on there too. But isn't that just cute with that little guy in there? Anyways, it's going to be adorable to decorate for, you know, any different holiday. And it's not real big, so you could actually put it in the bathroom. Wouldn't this be cute on your bathroom counter with, you know, say, um, you know, like a, a nice smelly candle and maybe a thing with, you know, some Q-tips in it or cotton balls or whatever you wanted to have. Um, but it would, or some nice smelly lotion. You could have a pump lotion sitting on here. Be really cute. So all kinds of ideas for this little tray. And of course, it's great for just decor. You could set it on your kitchen counter and put things on it. So I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet. I kind of got it for something like maybe for the new house. Um, I'm going to, but oh, I didn't tell you what, it was $9.99. That's, I, I was like, when I saw the price tag, I was like, well, I'm just going to grab it. It's so cute because they have little feet on the bottom. See here? Don't you love this? I saw some more there today when I was in. I actually went back to TJ Maxx today because I wanted to start my Christmas shopping. So cute, right? So anyways, that's adorable. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. I don't want my gnome to get hurt, so I'm going to set him over here without the top so it doesn't get hurt. Okay, and then I think I'm going to show you now. I just went to... Um, Dollar Tree, because um, I was looking for something in particular, bubble wrap. I went to get bubble wrap. They sell a little bits of bubble wrap, um, but I couldn't find any there. They didn't have any. So I did pick up some foam, because I want to make a little, like a little floral arrangement for Christmas. So I picked up some foam, because the rest of my stuff I took over to storage. <laughs> I've gotten most of my craft stuff over at storage right now. I only kept out the things I thought I'd use. These are the... Um, individual ones that are like that you know you can always use those to stuff in between but I bought some of that just you know these for making a flower arrangement if I give her get to it and then I always try to pick up some of their tissue it's only a dollar you get eight sheets in there this one has what's it have on it oh little cars with Santa in them and stuff cute and then it's you know red on the back and there's eight sheets in here so I bought two of the one with the little trucks or real little cars. I got one that's got just star, you know, just like that red and it's got some green in it. It probably has some other stuff in there. And then this one was cute because it's got little Santas all, or little snowmen all over it. Eight, eight sheets in here. So that's not bad for a dollar. 
I don't know how much this stuff is. You know, I haven't, I usually always have to pick up some more of this during the seasons. And then I picked up, they have their, um, what they call their handmade cards. You know, they have handmade cards there. And they're so pretty. So I picked up this one. It says, tis the season. And it's got this tree on the front. And then it just says, wishing you a very Merry Christmas and a New Year full of promise. But these are just real cute. This one's adorable too. It says, Noel. Look at it. They look better in person. So there's two, and I have a couple others, too, in here. There's one that looks like this. So pretty. Isn't that pretty? It says, peace, joy, and love. They're pretty, pretty little cards. And then I got this one that says, um, let heaven and nature sing. They're very much prettier in person than they are looking on the camera here. <laughs> they look so cute. You know, they're a dollar a piece. And then they had this cute little one that's in colors like that with a VW with all the presents on top. I just thought it was cute. At first, I thought maybe this was a money one, but it's not. It's just a skinny card. But anyway, so I got all those cards. And then I picked up these because I think I'm going to hand them out to my family. Oh, here's another one I missed. This one's cute. Warm wishes with the snow um, with the mittens. I just think it's super cute. Super cute. Okay. But anyways, I picked up. They had all their little um, mugs or the what are these? The, they're called tumblers. These tumblers. I read that these are supposed to keep your stuff cold or hot. Probably I don't know how well they do, but it does say that. But this one has gnomes all over it. Just so cute. Look at that. For Christmas, so I think my my sister doesn't go to Dollar Tree very often because well, there's one over her direction. But I thought I'd you know hand her off one of these because she'd like them. She thinks they're cute. I got this one that has like um, cocoa, you know, cocoa's on it, a little with uh, fro you know frosting, <laughs> with whipped cream, you know, on top. I just thought that was cute too. So that's that one and that one. Whoops. And then of course there's one with the green truck. Or the truck, the red truck with the green tree in the back. So these are all super cute, adorable. You know, you can make the, a little gift out of these and put some candy in it for just a, a sweet friend of yours or whatever. They're just super cute. Adorable. And these all, um, I didn't know how these work, but they twist off. I have one that I use that uh, Thanksgiving on. I have a Christmas one from last year too. But I think it was just super cute, don't you think? I think this gnome one's my favorite. It's just so adorable. With those gnomes on it, isn't it cute? <laughs> I just love gnomes. And then my daughter likes these kind of cups and I got her, I just picked this up so she could have it. It's just got a trucks with um, trees in it too. So it's just a, you know, to keep put water in and stuff like that. I don't know. Uh, you know, I'll have to test it and let you know how good they are. Anyway, so I got all that stuff, and I just, just like I said, I just thought that they're really cute. And for a dollar, this is really a good deal. And they have these sleeves on them, so if it's hot in there, I guess, I'm going to burn your hand. All right, so last thing, I went to TJ Maxx this morning. And today was the second time I saw this girl there that I know she's in there looking for Ray Dunn stuff because she's in line waiting at the door. Our TJ Maxx opens at 10 o'clock, and I swear, I swear she's there before 9.30. I'm sitting, waiting to get into the door, because that's what she's looking for. She and another girl were both in there looking for a Ray Dunn. I don't think they found any today, but that's what they were looking for. And I wouldn't be surprised if that, that's where they go every, you know, every morning. They hit that same spot. Okay, here I've got a little bit of, like, Christmas stuff that I'm buying for gifts. So the first thing I saw, and I was pretty happy with the price tag on this, I got this Magnolia Table cookbook. Isn't that beautiful? And it was $14.99. Normally at a regular store, it would be $29.99. So they had several of these there. And they've got 
like beautiful pictures. You know, she shows you exactly how you're, like if you're making biscuits, how they're gonna, you know, as you make them, how it should look and stuff. She's good about doing that. She's got, you know, all kinds of, here's like some orange walnut sweet rolls. The pictures are beautiful. I want to look through it. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm not sure. I just bought this because I knew I'd, I'll give it to somebody, but I'm not quite sure who yet. But it's just a great, like, coffee table book or something like that. I have some of these. Um, I have one of these boxes, like, in my hallway here, over in my hall, um, my, in my art niches. But I just thought this was cute, and it's for Christmas. So it's just a little box. This is Mary. Christmas has, well, my sister, my daughter won't like that because it has glitter on it, but it says a little Merry Christmas tag on the top, has that, and it was $9.99. Quill and Paper by Sixtress is what it says. But anyways, isn't that cute? So I can just replace the one over there and I can put a little Christmas in my little art niches, so that's my plan. So anyways, I got that and that cookbook, and then... I found these and um, I watch channel, her name is Jean E and she's a small channel. She's got like two or 3,000 people watching her. Um, and I don't think her channel is growing very well. So if you wanna go take a look at her channel, um, she has a fabulous amount of Ray Dunn. She loves Ray Dunn and she loves this Terra Moto. Well, I followed these there. I have one other piece of Terra Moto that I have. I, I have a little, a little picture and it's got hearts on it and it's for like Valentine's. Well, these are just um, striped ones, and these are the Terramoto, Terramoto, and it says right on the bottom, and I guess this is a designer, I'm not very, it's a, it says Terramoto ceramic, and these are super cute. It's just a red bowl, oh, there we come. A red bowl, red pot polka dots. And I just thought these would be cute, you know, in like my bigger two-tier tray or something. So you got the red one and then the striped one. Super cute, right? And these were $4.99. But Terraboto. And they also had a pitcher or like a teapot, tea kettle. Well, it's all, it was all like they made out of this, like ceramic. Super cute, but it was, had, um, Red hearts all over it. It was really adorable. <laughs> really adorable, but I didn't think I needed it. But I thought these were kind of cute, and they would, you know, you could use them on a two-tier tray or something. So, anyways, there's that. Then I'm going to quickly show you this. I found Aaron a shirt. He likes anything athletic. It was $14.99. It's an Adidas, just an Adidas shirt. You know, those, you know, slinky. I call them slinky because <laughs> they, you know, they're real soft. These ones have, has, has the stripes on the top. It's kind of a gray blue and it has, you can barely see it, but there's Adidas right up there in the corner. <laughs> but yeah, he likes this kind of stuff. So I picked that up for Aaron for a gift for Christmas. And then I picked up some Lucky Brand jewelry. They carry a Lucky Brand at my TJ Maxx. So they come in beautiful boxes. Look at that, beautiful boxes. Now this is a set of earrings, and they're very simple earrings. They're not like, you know, special. They're just a very beautiful like silver hoop, but they're kind of um, not shiny. They're kind of, um, you know, they're kind of um, matte looking. They're not super shiny, but aren't those pretty? They were $9.99. They're very lightweight, I can tell by the, so they won't like, pull on your ears and everything. They were $9.99 and they come in this beautiful little box. My sister's probably getting this stuff. <laughs> now look at the box here of a necklace. You gotta see. Now this necklace is like this. It's just a, like one that's gonna hang down you um, in the front. It was $12.99. Now this one, I think you can wear it either way because it's got a, just a plain silver, so you can do silver and silver, but it also has this um, print that I saw on a lot of like the earrings and stuff. So you can wear it like that too. So you have a little bit of 
difference. So I think that's probably how you're supposed to wear it. But I thought that was real cute. And I thought this was something my sister would like, something like this. So I got her that. And it was only $12.99. And then I got one more. Look at that print on that box. Isn't that pretty? I notice they have Lucky Brand like clothing sometimes, but I don't get it very often. I don't see it. Now this one I really loved. And I think this one you can turn around too. This one is just a long, uh, you know, it's white on this side, white, um, if you get to stay. Yeah, white on that side. And then you can wear it the other way too if you want. It's got like a little silver design on it. So you can wear it either way. I actually got this one for myself. I'll have my husband give it to me. It's um, $14.99. But I just thought it was pretty with that. That simple style, you know, that um, and it's really pretty. And then, you know, like I said, it's, it's that color like that. And then it switches to where you can just have this silver um, that has a little bit of a design on it. But what I loved about these is the boxes are so cute. Anyways, that's it. I just wanted to share all that with you. So I hope to see you soon. And I hope you enjoyed my little haul that I have. And next time I see you, we're going to be making that wreath. So I look forward to it. I hope to see you soon and you'll come back and join me. Take care, everybody. Love you.